वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम ऑल होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल एट होम टूडे वी विल स्टार्ट अ न्यू चैप्टर लेसन इलेवन सिंपल मशीन सो लेट स्टार्ट इट इज एविडेंट फ्रॉम हिस्ट्री दैट मैन हैज बीन मेकिंग एंड यूजिंग टूल्स सिंस एशियन टाइम्स प्रिमेटिव मैन यूज स्क्रेपर्स नाइव एंड नीडल्स मेड फ्रॉम स्टोन एंड बोन्स ऑफ एनिमल्स In modern times we use tools such as a screw driver hammer pliers utility knife with blades adjustable wrench lever and many more all these tools help us with our work simple machines a machine is a tool that can do work it is a device which helps us to do work easily by applying less force and less energy machines can be simple with a few or no moving parts or complex comprising two or more simple machines example of simple machines are a knife a blade a hammer etc a bicycle a swing machine and a hand pump are some examples of complex machines types of simple machines depending on the basic principles of working simple machines can be divided into six main types namely lever inclined plane screw pulley wheel and axle and wedge lever a lever is the simplest form of machine it is a rigid body or a metal rod or a wooden stick which acts as a lever it rotates around a fixed point of support This fixed point is called the fulcrum and is denoted by the letter F. The force applied to a lever or any other machine is called the effort. The point at which a force is applied is called the effort point and is denoted by the letter E. The distance between the fulcrum and the effort point is called the effort arm of the lever. The resistance overcome by a lever or any other machine is called the load. The point at which this load acts is called the load point denoted by L. The distance between the fulcrum and the load is called the load arm of the lever. Based on the position of the load and the effort, levers are classified into three types. Class 1 lever or lever of the first type. In this lever, the fulcrum F lies in between the effort E and the load L. Examples of class 1 lever are a pair of scissors, pliers, seesaw and crowbar. Class 2 lever or lever of the second type. In this lever, the load L is between the fulcrum F and the effort E. Examples of class 2 lever are nutcracker, wheelbarrow, paper cutter, bottle opener and claw hammer. class 3 lever or lever of the third type in this type of lever the effort e lies between the fulcrum f and the load l as shown in the figure examples of class 3 lever are a stapler a pair of tongs a human arm a broom and a tweezer next is inclined plane you must have observed slopes in hospitals airports malls or railway stations instead of stairs Such slopes or ramps are used for moving loads or wheelchairs. Such slopes or ramps are called inclined planes. Screw. A screw is a simple machine which works on the principle of an inclined plane. The grooves or threads of a screw are wound around a rod with a pointed tip like a nail. The spiral grooves of the screw which are made by cutting the surface of a metal rod are called the threads of the screw the pointed end is the tip and flat end is the head of the screw it is easier to drive a screw into a block of wood using a screw driver than to hammer it in because of better grip screws can support considerably larger loads for example a car jack a wise etc wedge a small piece of wood or metal which is thick at one end and thin at the other end is called a wedge when two inclined planes are joined together in the shape of a v we get a wedge 
wedges are often used by woodcutters and carpenters for cutting and splitting for example knives axe and needles wheel and axle the wheel and axle is one of the six types of simple machines which consists of a rounded wheel attached to an axle in such a manner that both parts rotate together to minimize friction for example in a door knob the rounded knob acts as a wheel and the shaft extending into the door represents the axle examples of a wheel and axle are the steering wheel of a vehicle pedals of a bicycle a screwdriver a water tap and wheel barrows pulley a pulley is a simple machine made with a wheel and axle with a chain a rope or a cord attached to it have you ever lifted a bucket full of water from the well a pulley makes work easier as it changes the direction of motion to work with gravity to raise a load a pulley changes the direction of the effort that is the direction in which force should be applied a pulley system saves effort when more than one pulley work all together for example a combination of pulleys reduces the effort to lift the load to a small force in the engine of a motor car three pulleys are connected with the help of a rubber belt making it easier to rotate other applications of pulleys can be seen in cranes lifting heavy loads and curtain blinds being lifted in houses and theaters many exercise equipments use pulley to function a cargo lift system escalators and bulldozers use pulley system that's all about simple machines thank you and have a nice day